Hello, my friends. Welcome to Nanny and the Moose. I want you to enjoy this video. You're going to love it. It includes my return after my second shopping haul at Walmart. And it includes me trying on some of these outfits around the property, dragging my stool and my my tripod and my camera. And um, I think I need an assistant at this point. <laughs> so, your assistant. oh, he's my assistant, Hi, my well. moosey. <laughs> he's I'll painting. He's been painting. Oh yeah, he'll carry the camera, he says. <laughs> Uh, he's back to his painting again. He's been doing some beautiful paintings. My shopping strategy when I shop at Walmart is to try and find some classic pieces like that beautiful silky denim shirt, which can go with so many things, and um, other items. I think that the striped t-shirt dress is very classic. And as a mature woman, I do prefer the more classic things, which you can find at Walmart, and put them with a, a good straw bag, a good pair of shoes, a cute hat, and, and you can make that outfit look like a million bucks. So um, my, sh my shopping might be a little bit different being a more mature woman, and um, it's, it's kind of fun uh, hunting down the item. I have sewn most of my life, and usually what I would do is if I saw some designer outfit or some outfit that was just too pricey for me over the years, I would recreate it. I would uh, almost right down to the T, I could recreate some Ralph Lauren outfits or Marc Jacobs or, or whatever. And it's kind of fun doing the same thing, shopping in the lower priced places. I'm on a Walmart high. I went back two days later because I had so much fun the first time I went to Walmart and did my big haul. I went back and guess what? They've just stocked all the shelves again and they had all kinds of stuff. I also do a lot of food shopping there. So I'm going to make a pasta salad for my grandson, Brendan. And I had to get the pepperoni and the cheese and the squiggly pasta and all those things that he loves. He's alone, he's batching it 16 for the weekend right here with us in the big house. And his mom and dad have gone to New York with Ryan and Shannon and they're at Fordham checking out the campus for Ryan. I only got four outfits finished. So we'll have to kind of extend the try on to the next video. But some of the ones that I tried on, I did have a favorite. And I think you'll see as we go on and I'll put on there my favorite. I'll tell you now what it was. I love the blue and white nautical striped tea dress. I loved the length of it. I loved the way it fit me. I loved the neckline and you can wear it with a straw hat. It looked cute. I had some navy blue espadrille type shoes that I wore with it. That was my favorite. No, but remember I went back for the t-shirt dresses. I'm so excited. I found a beautiful black t-shirt dress that is long. It's quite a bit below the knee, which is the length that I like. Not quite tea, but down by the calves somewhere. So I got one of those. I think they're $12. And at the same time, I was looking for a dark navy solid, but they had a lighter uh, blue color, which I didn't like. But this is another tea dress. I love my stripes. I'm not wild about prints, but I do love stripes. I think they're very classic and nautical looking. And another t-shirt dress, which is also, I think, that same length nice and long. This one actually came with a belt, but might not use the belt. Well, I kind of had another favorite too. I did get a cute t-shirt that um, actually it was, um, it's not a t-shirt, it's a, I never wear them, so I don't know what they're called. It's like a men's old fashioned nightshirt and it, it doesn't have sleeves. What the, oh, it's a tank. It's a tank and it has a cute saying on it. And I couldn't resist it. It was only $5.96, I think. And I, I just loved it. Some of these things that I bought today, I didn't plan on it, but 
you know when you see them i think they just restocked a whole bunch of things but i also will show you what i got in the other haul if i do some maybe out here somewhere i can do some try-ons look at this jean shirt it's it's a dress jean shirt it's almost a blend of a cotton and a silk. I don't know whether it is silk, but it sure feels like it. And it would look really nice over maybe a, a black tee, which I bought a cute one that has a cute saying on it. And I'll wear that with my new long Palazzo pants, maybe tie it at the waist. So I got that, I think this was $12. These new ribbed pants that I bought on my second time back to Walmart made another surprise haul. And these pants are also the wider length, but only by about a foot. Love the pants. They have pockets. They're so comfortable. And I think they'll wash and dry beautifully and not, not wrinkle at all. So this video is not going to include any makeup, even though I did get a good makeup haul. Um, I did get some brushes in the mail, um, beaky brushes. Oh, they're wonderful. In fact, they're listed in the top 20 brushes for various things and they were under ten dollars aren't they great but we'll have to talk about those in the next video plus some new makeup that i got i'm trying out a lighter uh type of a it's not it's really a primer it's not a foundation i don't have foundation on because um i didn't like the look of it outside it's a good indoor makeup and i guess you have to be careful what looks good inside doesn't necessarily look good outside. So we won't get into too much of the makeup, but we do talk about the, the dresses and the pants and the tank top and the beautiful silky uh, denim shirt. Love that. Um, the black tee that I bought was too big, so I'm going to have to take it back. And it was not as long as the other one. I like that mid calf. So they're two different brands and I didn't really like the way the, the black one fit. It was, it was too large. So I'll probably take that one back, but everything else that I got, I loved. I made a pasta salad for Brendan and I did a quick little one and a half minute uh, recipe for you, a running recipe that you should make. Brendan has been eating it all weekend. His parents are away in New York City. Uh, his sister has uh, committed to Fordham. They've been touring the campus and we just heard and saw pictures. They're not back yet. They'll be back tomorrow. So she, she did beautifully. Have a new great grandbaby. And I have to get permission to put her picture on. She's so beautiful. She's a week old. And my daughter, Margie, is the new grandma. She is Gigi, not grandma, but Margie, Gigi. So uh, there's a gorgeous picture of Margie with the new baby, and I will put it on maybe on our next video. The next video that I'm going to be doing is going to be mostly probably makeup because in my haul, just a couple days ago, on my second trip back to Walmart, I did get some really great uh, makeup and a couple of products. And I've also received in the mail some other special products. So we might make this a whole makeup haul. So I promised him I'd make his salad, which I'm gonna do tomorrow morning. And it's my signature pasta salad with olives and cheese and pepperoni and the kids love it. But this video is gonna be another haul. Now, some of the things I have outside that are fresh. I do have um, cilantro, which I will put some fresh cilantro in here. My dill just hasn't been growing, so I have uh, some nice dill weed here.
Don't we all love cheese? Doesn't that look yummy? The Italian dressing is what gives it a little pop. And that's why I mix it with the mayo and sometimes the ranch or all three. My cilantro from my garden. Fantastic pasta salad. And everybody loves this. So we will have it for supper. Brenda will have it for the next three days for lunch till mom and dad. There he come is. Home. How do you like it? It's my favorite, my favorite meal that you make for sure. Does look good, I'm huh? I'm eating it four times today. <laughs> well, enjoy, Brendan. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. I also found, look at this. In the deli section, this wonderful, nice pizza, four cheese pizza, which Moose and I will have tonight for, look at that price. $2.70. It was another Walmart haul. And I think if I don't eat too much pizza and other goodies that I bought there, I might do a try on of all these nice new things I've gotten. I'll just give you a little peek. Let me put my pizza down for a minute. I did stop and bring Moose and Brendan home some burritos for lunch, but I'm skipping that. I'm waiting for the pizza tonight. So, look what I found. Look at this cute sweater. It's really nice fabric, and it has a nice sort of a, a ribbed edge. This would look cute with black pants as well. Or maybe just put over one of my tea dresses because I don't like to show the upper arms, so maybe that might hide the upper arms on the tee. But I did get the tea dresses which I went out to find. Let me put I'm this I'm wearing one of my Walmart hauls and I love it. It fits very, very nicely. And uh, I like things loose. I don't like them too awfully tight. It has buttons down the front. As you can see, I have my shoulder pads. They're one of my never, never, never show your age. And getting that square look in the shoulders is one of my tips. Love, love, love it. Um, I like it with the gold jewelry. And um, I have my grandmother's locket on. And I love this. I wear this with the pants. In fact, you'll see it in the try-on. And, whoo, throwing everything in the trunk here. And I found these. These are, and I don't think these will wrinkle as much as the rayon ones. These are kind of a, a ribbed polyester. See the fabric? You can see it up close. And these are also palazzo pants with a, um, a nice waist. It's not the, the wide ribbed. They go down to a, a palazzo bottom of, I'd say, approximately a foot. Everything is wider pants these days, but these are long down past the ankles. They might even go over the shoe. So I did well. So that's about it. This is filled with some goodies from the makeup department and I will save these to show you in the next video. Fun. I did get some good stuff. So I'm going to have a little lunch. I brought Del Taco back to Moosey and Brendan, but I bought myself a nice little tub and I won't eat it all of artichoke jalapeno dip. And I'm having that with a few crackers. Gosh, they must have restocked these because they do have more of the light khaki. I found one in black. They do have some navy blues. Now here's something I have fallen in love with. It's a long skirt with a slit up the front, a little ruffle on the bottom. It's beachwear, and it has the cutest tank top, which I will turn it around and show you. Little cute tank top for the top. Now, I can't see me in the top, but I certainly love this skirt with maybe a white t-shirt knotted at the waist. Oh, so cute. Well, I found the t-shirt dresses, just what I came up for. They have uh, a few in the olive color, some in a black and white stripe. I don't like this blue, it's too bright. I was hoping for a navy. Just amazing the array of things I have, and yet I can't find Maybelline, Almay, Revlon, Wet n Wild, LA Girl, Ooh, everything. 
and I can't find nice roll-on cheek blush. I did just get a wonderful beaky brush set for under $10 on Amazon and it's rated in the top 20. It's a set of I think a dozen brushes but look at these pretty elf brushes. I came into the makeup department to find some cream blushes and I discovered these Nudes of New York Maybelline a palette, which I love because I'm going lighter on my eyes. And the other one is a smaller one called the Nudes, also made by Maybelline New York. The um, fashion show is about to begin. I wish it were longer, but I will uh, do some more next video. Maybe I'll do one or two each video, at least maybe one. I hope you noticed my Walmart earrings. I think they were $5.96. And I didn't realize it, but they match my new Walmart sweater. Don't you love them? They're big, pretty big hoops. And I thought they were uh, like the tortoise shell that would match my, my glasses. And actually, I suppose they do, but they really match this sweater. So the jewelry in Walmart is fabulous too. Well, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed my first try on. I was a little nervous as to how to move and what to do, but I think I'll get better. I have all my little insecurities going, but I'll get over them, don't worry. I love you all. Oh, the comments that you're all making on the beauty haul and, and all my videos. I'm just enjoying our little conversations I feel like we're all friends. But for those of you who have not subscribed yet, please become part of our group and, and join in the fun. I appreciate you all so much. Thank you for watching.